In today's video, I'm going to show you how to track 3D titles into your video using Adobe After Effects. So let's get right into it. So once you've launched Adobe After Effects and you have your footage imported ready to go, we need to go into the Effects and Presets window and search for 3D Camera Tracker. Drop the 3D Camera Tracker onto the video and After Effects will begin analyzing your footage. So once After Effects has finished analyzing your footage, all of these different tracking points will be presented with you. And if you hover over each individual tracking point, then a target will load up on the footage. Now, depending on where you want to place your text in your video will depend on which target you press. Now, if you wanted to place your text in the space on the left on the ground, you would want to select one of the tracking points on the ground. So once you've found your point, you want to right click or double click if you're on Mac and go down to create text and camera. Now that will generate a text layer and a camera layer. And if we play through the video, you can see that the text is perfectly sticking with the video. But of course we don't want the word text in our video. So let's customize this. Let's type out, let's type Hey for now. And if we scroll through again, we can see that this text is perfectly sticking with the video. But the problem is this text is currently 2D and we want to create a 3D text layer. So let's go into the settings on this text layer. Let's go into transform. We'll go down to geometry options and we'll change the renderer from classic 3D to cinema 4D. Press OK on this window. And then if we go down to the extrusion depth and we pull this all the way up, you can see that you can adjust the depth of the text. So let's pull this all the way up to around 12. And if we go up to the Y rotation, pull this back down to zero. You can see that we have a nice deep 3D text layer sitting perfectly on our video. But let's go through the X, Y and Z rotation settings and try and perfectly position this text layer within the scene. So I'm going to adjust the X rotation, the Y rotation and the Z rotation to make sure this perfectly sits. And as soon as you're happy with that, we can close off the transform window. And then if you select onto the text layer and go over to the character window on the right of After Effects, if we change the color of the text, you can see the color of the 3D text will also change. Using the 3D tracker might feel really daunting and really intimidating to begin with, especially when you see all of those tracking points presented to you. But applying 3D text to your video is actually a lot simpler than it first seems. So rewatch this tutorial as many times as you need and go create some amazing 3D titles in your video. And there you go. If you enjoyed watching this video, then please do let me know in that comment section below. And don't forget to subscribe and check out the previous video if you want to see more. Thank you for watching and I will see you on the next episode.